what experiment are we doing today? Um, we're going to investigate, do plants need soil to grow? What equipment do we need? So the children will need five plastic cups per pair, different types of materials to plant the seeds in. So you've got some cotton wool, paper towel, so you've got soil, some sand, you need a jug of water, and then another little pot for measuring the water and some radish seeds. Can you use any seeds? Absolutely, any seeds that germinate, easy, uh, but they do need to be fresh. And do you have any practical tips about this experiment? Once you've sown the seeds, if you just cover the top of the pot with cling film and just poke some holes in the top to let some air in. Yeah, so it keeps um, them moist, essentially. keeps them moist, um, but they, they do need um, the air as well. Would you water the pots throughout the week? Yeah, I think you would need to. You'd have to look at how much they were drying out, but just to remember that if you're going to water one medium, then you need to water the others with the same amount. Yeah. And are there any particular health and safety issues? Um, not as such. I think just after the experiment, children just need to remember to wash their hands. And what are the important teaching points that come out of this experiment? So at the end of the experiment, it will show that the seeds have germinated in each of the mediums, it's also a good experiment for identifying independent variables and dependent variables, um, making predictions and establishing what a fair test means and how you set one up. Ah, so you're very you're careful to say same amount of water in each one, same Absolutely, number of seeds yeah. in each one. Um, and only changing one thing, the one thing that we are changing is what the seeds are attempting to germinate in or on. Yeah. They all pretty much look like this, actually. It yes. should be a surprise yeah. to them, perhaps. Yeah, I think so. I think they wouldn't expect some of the ones in, in the sand to look so healthy, where you associate deserts as being dry, inhospitable habitats mm. um, and that not much could, could grow there. So, um, yeah, it's an interesting experiment to perhaps dispel some of those common yeah. misconceptions. And make clear that difference between germinating, which they'll all do, and then growing is important. Yes. Um, what, what you'll get after a week or ten days um, is still the germination process, um, but beyond that is, is when the, the, the seeds um, are starting to try and grow. So I suppose if, if you run the experiment a little bit longer, then you'll see that the the ones in the soil then start to grow. Yes, change. I think that would be an interesting follow-up in investigation. The longer the, the seeds are in their medium, um, the more of the children will start to see. Some do better than others. Mm -hmm.